Hello and welcome to this course. I'm new to cloud computing, what's it all about? My name is Stuart Scott and I'm an Amazon Web Services trainer here at Cloud Academy. And I'm going to guide you through this course and give you a solid understanding of what cloud computing is. So who should attend this course? This course is intended for anyone who wants to learn about cloud computing and that may have no or very little knowledge of it currently. It's for those of you who are looking to learn more about the cloud to decide if it's something you want to adopt within your business perhaps. Or those of you that may be seeking a career move and want to learn the foundation of cloud principles, then this course is certainly for you. So looking at what we're going to cover today, and as this is a foundation and beginner course of cloud computing, I shall be discussing and explaining the following key areas. Firstly, what is cloud computing? I'll give you a definition of what it is in its most simplest form. Then we'll look at cloud deployment models. In this section, there are three clear models to cover here. And then we'll move on to key cloud concepts. So here we'll be talking about what makes a cloud a cloud. Then moving on to cloud service models. And these differ from deployment models and focus more on the services offered by the cloud. After that, we'll look at some common use cases of cloud computing, and here I'll give a few examples of what organizations are using cloud computing for within their business. And then lastly, we'll look at how data center architecture is reflected within the cloud. So here I will explain how certain functions such as routers and switches are reflected within the public cloud. So now we've looked at what you're going to learn and what you're going to cover, and that's all well and good. But what will you actually personally gain from attending this course? On completion of this course, you will have a comprehensive understanding of cloud computing along with its key concepts and benefits. This will allow you to determine when cloud computing should be used and which model and service to deploy. It will also give you a solid foundation to continue on with deeper learning about the cloud. So there's just a couple of prerequisites to this course. Firstly, it's for you to have a basic understanding of server hardware components, such as CPU, RAM, disks, etc. And secondly, to have a basic understanding of what a data center is. So basically, your server farm, where your hardware, your servers, your network equipment is typically housed in a standard environment. And that brings us to the end of this first lesson. Let's move on to lesson two, what is cloud computing?